Hi, Sean Sturbel, Warranty Manager here at Charleston Homes. And today I wanted to talk to you in this blog about the cold weather and how it affects your new home. So with the new home, you're gonna have excess moisture because of all the building components, uh, the materials that went into that home. So as you turn on the heat in the colder we weather, the moisture starts to come out of those materials and becomes airborne. Um, you can monitor your levels by the use of a hygrometer. Essentially, the weather stations, most of those have a, uh, a percentage for the, the moisture content in the home, and essentially that's what a hygrometer is. Um, you could get one with a remote where you could put one downstairs and you can keep one on your main floor. Um, but the biggest thing um, with that is just to kind of know where you're at with your moisture content in your home. Um, so some people will want to automatically um, put more moisture into their home with the use of a humidifier. Well, per our warranty book and per our recommendations, generally speaking, we don't want anybody to run that humidifier if equipped in your new home for the first year or two. And the reason being is you've already got so much moisture in the house. Typically, you want to be between 40 and 55% moisture content. Um, 55 being if you have wood floors, the 40% being if you don't have wood floors. Um, kind of some telltale signs of that is if you start to see some of your trim cracking or separating from the walls slightly, that may mean that your home's starting to really dry out. And generally you start to see that after the second or third year. And then that's when you'd want to enlist the help of a humidifier to add that extra moisture in there. The first year or two, you want to kind of work on getting that extra moisture out of your home. And that could be in the spring and summer, the use of a dehumidifier. So in the winter time, when you do turn on your heat, that moisture starts to evaporate out of those materials. And as it's evaporating, you'll start to see um, some condensation on the windows per se, because the windows are going to be a colder surface than the walls. And so the warm molecules will actually touch that glass and turn into condensation, much like in the summertime, if you have a glass of iced tea or ice water and it's hot outside, you see the sweating of the glass. The reverse is true for inside your home with the outside being the colder spot and the inside being warmer. So it's perfectly normal to live in a brand new home, um, as energy efficient as we can build them and still see condensation. Um, you could have top of the line windows or bottom of the line windows it doesn't matter because it all comes down to how much moisture is in the air and how that moisture is controlled. Um, running bath fans um, after bathing or while you're bathing or showering is a good idea because it's going to help take that extra moisture that you're putting into the air from the water running and vacate that to the exterior of the home. If you don't run bath fans while bathing or showering, it's going to add more to that and therefore you'll get more condensation. And the same is true if you're running a humidifier, even a standalone one, temporarily, um, you're adding more moisture to it. Now if things are getting a little bit dry, then that's when you want to add the moisture to it and that's when you would enlist the help of the humidifier. Um, as your home starts to dry out, you'll experience some uh, floor popping, um, and that's perfectly normal. The wood flooring may get a little bit of separation or gapping, perfectly normal. That's all part of the weather ring of the home. And as your home starts to dry out, then you can kind of figure out if you need to add moisture or take moisture out. So I uh, just want to talk a little bit about what to expect in the winter months um, as your home starts to dry out, so to speak. So. I want to thank you guys for tuning in our blog today. If you have any other questions, visit our website. Otherwise, check out our models or our website, charlestonhomesomaha.com. Thank you.